Hi, this is Aprajita from Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. In this video, we'll learn how to debug licensing issues for Proactive Outreach Manager. As we all know that Proactive Outreach Manager is a managed application which enables Avaya Voice Portal or Avaya Aura Experience Portal to run any outbound campaigns. It can use different modes of communication like voice calls, SMSs or emails and all of them require licenses for getting activated. Licensing for Proactive Outreach Manager is managed by VPMS for Avaya Voice Portal and Experience Portal Manager for Avaya Aura Experience Portal. POM's licensed features include email connections, SMS connections, and maximum number of outbound ports that can be used to make any outbound voice calls to the customers. POM's licensing information can be accessed on the web administration by navigating to Licensing Residing Under Security. Let's begin our exercise by logging into Avaya or Experience Portal's web administration page. Here I am logging in using admin user and its respective password. When I hit login button, on this web page I can see an error saying licenses for proactive outreach manager are in grace period. So let's see if there are any alarms related to this by going to alarm manager residing under system maintenance. On this alarm manager page, first of all we have to choose the date and time for which we want to see the alarms. Then we uncheck all the alarm related categories here and check EP licensing as this is the process which provides us license related alarms from the system. When we click OK, it generates an alarm report. On this alarm report, we can see there are number of license related alarms listed. QLIC E0016 says that licenses are in grace period, whereas QLIC E0013 says that licenses are not available on the WebLM server, which means we may have to install a new license file. If we click on the event code hyperlink here, we can see more details about this alarm code. We can see event message explaining details about this alarm. Similarly, we can see details about other alarms as well. Let's go to licensing page under security. This page contains complete license related information about experience portal as well as proactive outreach manager. When we click license server URL, on this page we'll have to click verify which takes us to the license manager screen where our licenses are hosted. Now just click license administration here to make any changes to the licenses. Login with valid login name and password. This page clearly shows that there are no licenses for POM under licensed products. Although there are licenses installed for voice portal. So let's try to install a new license file by browsing its path. I am pointing to the license file available on my local system and click install. As a confirmation, I can see a message saying licenses have been installed successfully and POM listed in the left pane. When I click POM, I can see the details about the installed licenses. It says 50 SMS channels, 50 email channels and 50 outbound ports. Let's go back to the license server URL page. We'll save the changes just made on the WebLM server by clicking save and the confirmation message says that the information has been saved successfully and if we look below on this screen proactive outreach manager licenses have been updated 
So this completes our demonstration. I hope this information was helpful. Thank you for watching. For any questions, comments or feedback, please write to mentor at avaya.com or follow us on Twitter at avaya mentor. Thank you for choosing Avaya.